Hi everyone, I'm Alex, and I'm here to introduce to you the new Kinetic Encabulator. I'm here to help you understand exactly what the Kinetic Encabulator is, and why you should back our Kickstarter. But first, let's take a look at it in action. Now you're probably wondering, what does the Kinetic Encabulator do? Well, let me help you understand with this illustration. Let's break this down. For a number of years now, work has been proceeding in order to bring perfection to the crudely conceived idea of a device that would not only supply inverse reactive current for use in unilateral phase detractors, but would also be capable of automatically synchronizing cardinal grammeters. There's been many attempts, but that's where the Kinetic Encabulator comes in. Hi, I'm Alan, CEO of Kinetic Industries. Now, the only real new principle involved is that instead of power being generated by the relative motion of conductors and fluxes, it's produced by the modial interaction of magneto-reluctance and capacitive directance. The original machine had a base plate of pre-famulated amulite, surmounted by a malleable logarithmic casing in such a way that the two spurving bearings were in a direct line with the panometric fan. With our trade secret additions to this devastating device, the efficiency of the new bioptic processor standard in every kinetic encabulator far exceeds that of its predecessors. The lineup consisted simply of six hydrocoptic marzal veins, so fitted to the amp-efficient lunar wane shaft that side fumbling was effectively prevented. The main winding was of the normal Lotus O'Deltoid type, placed in panendermic semi-soloid slots of the stator, every seventh conductor being connected by a non-reversal tremie pipe to the differential girdle spring on the up end of the grammeters. Additionally, whenever fluorescence core motion is required, it may also be employed in conjunction with a drawn reciprocation dingle arm in order to reduce sinusoidal deplaneration. The kinetic encabulator has now reached a high level of development and is currently being successfully used in the operation of Novotrunions. We really want to get this product in the hands of everyday people, but to do that, we need your support. Please back our Kickstarter. 